Always good advice mm -hmm. to fight for, I prefer the unicorn, but you know what? Yeah. All right, since March is Women's History Month, we wanted to celebrate some small women-owned businesses. Joining us now live is lifestyle contributor Jennifer Uwe. Jen, we love seeing you. Any, any excuse to support small businesses, right? Yes, exactly. And we are applauding these women's achievements, and they are continuing to inspire us along the way. Oh, absolutely. So you've got some great brands here. Some I've heard of, some are new to me, so I'm excited to learn about the brands and the women behind them. So let's start with this shapewear. Okay, I have never seen such a beautiful shapewear in my life. The founder of Pinsy is Rachel Pinlock, and she started wearing shapewear when she was nine years old, Alyssa. And she just believed growing up that her body was meant, was meant to be covered and flaws covered. So throughout the years, she embraced her body, embraced her confidence, and started her own line, and Pinsy is shapewear that is made to be seen. Look how beautiful this is. Yeah, that is stunning. It looks more like lingerie, not like shapewear. Right. <laughs> yeah, it's perfect. You can put, pair it with a pair of jeans, put a blazer over it, or wear it with a skirt. But these shape and sculpt comfortably. I love that they offer sizes small to 3XL. Mm -hmm. um, and they're just so pretty. It's meant to be seen and shared. Well, I'm so glad that she had that realization that she did because uh, hearing a, about a nine-year-old who wants to wear shapewear is just heartbreaking, John. Um, right, okay. I agree. Okay, let's move on to these clothes here. Okay, Camille Corbin is the founder of Revel, and she comes from a family of entrepreneurs, so it's no surprise that she quit her nine-to-five job to follow her passion, and that includes creating looks that make people feel comfortable and confident in the clothes that they're in. So these are all hand-curated, and these are quality, comfortable, athleisure wear that you can use, you know, going Very out to nice. brunch lounging at home and then Alyssa I know you have the white version of this but I have the tan and this is from her new spring line okay wait I can't the hoodie yes, and the shorts cute. it's so cute and comfortable I just wore the hoodie the other day it's so comfortable <laughs> it also comes in green oh cute I love that yes and then she also has accessories so she has both men women um, clothing as well as accessories to just enjoy life yes. and revel in the moment. And I feel like lounge sets are having a major moment right now because you've got to be still put together. But we've got less than two minutes, Jen. So what else yes. do we have here? Okay, I have to share some of my two favorite beauty brands right now. Imagine working in the beauty industry and not being able to test anything. That's what the founder of Tower 28 has to deal with because she suffered from severe eczema. Oh, wow. So Amy Lou, I know, Amy Lou branched off on her own, created Tower 28, which is 100% clean, vegan, skin free of skin irritants. And you may have seen her Make Waves mascara. I mean, these, these continue continuously sell out. It's safe for sensitive eyes that don't leave you with any clumps. And their lip softies are my new favorite. This is new, and they deliver intense hydration to your lips, especially in this weird weather. Yes, it has been weird. Okay, and then you have some eyelash and eyebrow serum here too. So many people are thanking Alicia Grande for these because Alicia Grande started this line, Grande Cosmetics, after she started losing her lashes after pregnancy. I started losing my hair. I don't know about you, Alyssa. Mm -hmm, I sure did. But she created this, and since she created this in 2016, 10 million bottles of the Grande Lash MD have been sold. What's great about this is just you apply it above your lash line, and then in four to six weeks, you start to see longer, beautiful lashes. Ooh. And the same goes for the eyebrows. If you, you know, plucked a little too much in the 90s and you're still waiting for it to grow back, <laughs> this serum is packed with vitamins, antioxidants, amino acids to make you look your best. Okay, and uh, very quickly, because we've got to go, what are these accessories yes. here? These are beautiful accessories, perfect for springtime. This is uh, RPZL. Lisa Richards is the founder. 
of this It Salon um, in Rockefeller Center in New York. And she teamed up with her bestie, Ali Wolonski, who is a journalist, to come up with these fun feminine bows and headbands. So they're known not just for their salon, their blowouts, but um, like Paris Hilton, Gigi Hadid, go to RPZL for their hair extensions. Cute. And it is just a place to go and they ship nationwide. They're in salons nationwide as well. Okay, Jen, thank you so much and happy Women's History Month to you. You too, thank you.